What is up, YouTube? This is your boy, Connor Garrity, a.k.a. the GMoney041. You know what it is. I've been teasing this for a while that I was going to do this video. You know, I had to do it. I've been wanting to do this for a long time. Going to do this in the style of my man, Crispy Coil, because it's easier. And to rep him, we got the Wu-Tang Clan. Wu God, Ghostface Killer, and M-E-T-H-O-D, man. M-E-T-A, Woo! If I had a walk-up song in baseball, this would be my song. Sorry for the mess, y'all. Moving out tomorrow, going into the new room, so got to pack up. You know how it is, but let's get into this. Uh, as you can see, I got a ton of bait stuff here, and we even got some stuff over there. You know how it is, man. Just a lot of craziness. You know I love bait. Favorite shop in L.A., had to rep them, had to show them love today, haven't shown off the whole collection ever, so, you know, had to, had to do it, just had to do it, just had to do it, so, I'm gonna get into, uh, I'm actually gonna do the, uh, shirts first, and I'm gonna give you, and if this shirt is still available, I'll tell you, but a lot of these shirts are all limited editions, so, there are quite a few of these that you can't find anymore, and these were exclusives to certain events. And I'll give you the information about all of these if they are still available. So let's start off. We got our first one right here. We got my the Ryu Black Tee. For those who don't know, I love Street Fighter. As you can see, we got a ton of different Street Fighter shirts out here. Uh, this one was a limited edition, as you can see. 39 out of 150 glad to have got this this is no longer available this shirt's no longer available as well this one was the uh shirt uh helping the philippines after that whole tsunami those came with these shoes right here the vanquishes again really happy to have gotten the shirt with them as well this one is still available this is the uh one piece nami shirt Blocked out the skunk and I'm about to go and stick it. Yes, I'm about to go and stick it. I got. <laughs> Sorry, I had to do that. Love this song. This is my, again. If I had a walk-up song in baseball, this would be my song. Naughty shirt from Bait. Uh, this one's still available on the site, so I would pick that up. Love this shirt. Goes great with the uh, MIA dunks if you have that. This one's another limited edition. This is the black Akuma shirt. I don't have the white. This one is 67 out of 200. This was easily the most popular shirt. These ones resell for like 50 bucks online, so pretty crazy. We got the bait one piece pocket tee right here. Nothing on the back, but I love one piece. One of my favorite animes of all time. Had to pick that up. Moving up, we got the uh, Chun-Li driving shirt in black. They have a white version as well. These are still available. Same with the Sagats. These are non-limited editions. Uh, they have this one in white also, so you can pick that up. My boy Doll Scene. This was a San Diego Comic-Con exclusive. Picked this up off the site. It's still there as well. This one comes in black also, so you can pick it up right now. We've got the Bait Bones tee right here. Love it. It's got a really cool pocket logo on the front. Uh... This one's still available. It's also in black as well, so you can get that. This one's only available in black. This is the uh, Voltron Lions tee. Super sick tee. Very happy to have it. This is another San Diego Comic Con exclusive. So I'd get on this because they're not going to, once they sell out, they're not making any more of that. Zangief tee. This one available in black as well. Non limited edition. Still pick that up. These next two are limited. This is the M. Bison tee and the Ryu tee, both in white. Uh, I, again, missed out on the Akuma. They had an Akuma in white as well, and I don't have the Bison in black, but I think the Bison in black might still be available. This one was 31 out of 100, and my Bison T was, let's see, 77 out of 100. So the white series was only out of 100, not out of 150 like the other ones. Moving over, we got this other black Akuma tee. This one is a, di a little bit different of a design, as you can see. This one's available in white as well, and that one's still available online. This is my Ryu Street Fighter World Champions tee. The only problem with this tee is I live in L.A., and I'm an L.A. Dodger fan. I grew up an L.A. Dodger fan. You cannot wear this tee in L.A., man. People be giving you nasty looks because it's got the San Francisco colors, Street Fighter, SF. People think, oh, man, you repping the Giants. I can't be repping the Giants in L.A., man. No, no, that's not a good look. That's not a good look for your boy. 
We've got the bait knife tee right here. Super cool. This one is a pocket tee as well. It's got, I don't know if you can see it, but it's got a black B on the back. It's got one on the white on the front as well on the pocket with the knife going through it. Very sick. We got three hats here. I have three hats from bait. First one, we got the Bruin snack back. I love this one. This is by Mitchell and Ness as well. You got the, the bear and it's in UCLA colors. I love UCLA, so had to get that. And the next two, and I'll bring them over here. We've got the, both of them are one piece hats. We've got the black with the white crossbones. And I hope you can see that. Camo brim, super sick. Bait on the back, most wanted on the side. And we got the same one only in khaki with the camo brim and the red lettering and the black skull. Super sick, most wanted. Bait on the back of the shoe, on the back of it. We gotta throw these out there as well. We got three pairs of socks from Bait. First up, oh yeah, Raekwon baby. Is Raekwon the best member of Wu Tang Clan? I'm not sure, but he's one of the top ones. By the way, can't all be so simple. Snow Beach, repping. You know what I'm saying, man. That was a great, great music video, and they just did that collab with Saucony. I need to get those. I need to get those. Size ten and a half. If you have them. And you got a good price, shoot me. But uh, Bruce Lee socks, got these from Anime Expo. This was an Anime Expo exclusive, but they are online now. Check out your man on the back, though. Vicious Bruce Lee the God, one of my heroes. Rest in peace. We've got the, I'll put them right here. We've got the Vanquish socks to go along with the Vanquishes. Got these as a free as a freebie that was thrown in. Super cool, super cool. You know how it is. Love those socks. I wear those socks all the time when I rock these shoes and even when I don't rock those shoes. And then we got the Nippon Blue socks. These came with the Nippon Blues. Love them. I rocked actually this to Anime Expo. I rocked both of these at Anime Expo. I rocked those and uh, what tea did I rock to Anime I rocked my Nami tea to Anime Expo. I actually took a picture with a girl dressed as Nami. Oh my lord. Ladies and gentlemen. My god. She... That in She was that, but in real life. Just... Woo! <laughs> Let's move on to the shoes now. As you can see, I got uh, six pairs of Asics out here. I'm missing a couple... I'm missing four pairs to be specific, and those are all in the ring pack, and I'll explain that in a minute. Gonna try and finish this actually in under 15 minutes. So let's see, let's see, let's see if we can do that. Let's see if we can do that. So first up, we got the Phantom Lagoons. I love these shoes. These are like my most worn, second most worn out of all the bait collabs that I have. They came with these super cool rope laces, nubuck and suede all over the shoe. Love how the outside of the shoe. And the inside of the shoe is different. Just really cool detailing. And I love the sand bottom. The sand bottom is sick. It's kind of like a gum bottom. They don't, I don't have the box actually for this one. I actually have, um, these are on top of my uh, Ubique Midnight Blooms, which I actually got from Bait. So just saying, it's technically a Bait release. Uh, these ones are the Vanquishes and I'll show you the tag right now for these. Just a super sick shoe. I love the nail head suede. As you can see, I actually have the next two of the basics pack as well. Love this shoe. Probably my one of my most worn shoes of all time. Wear them all the time. Threw in my uh, threw in the dude uh, rope lace supplies laces. Just awesome shoe. Awesome, awesome shoe. Next up, I'm gonna change the song here. Ooh. Regulators! <laughs> For those who don't know this song, you need to know. Warren G, Nate Dog, Regulators! Mount up! <laughs> Put it back. Love this song. This is this is G Funk LA, man. This is this is this is stuff I grew up on, but getting back to what I was originally talking about, we got the Guardians right here. I got these from the Bait LA opening. These are still dead stock, actually. Uh, I need to wear these out. These are sick. I love... These are going to go so well in Texas because they're kind of like hunting shoes. These are sick. Love the extra laces that came with it. Got the extra laces here for the Knee Palm Blues, which are the next shoe. Love this one probably the most out of the basics pack because it is the most Japanese 
of all the shoes I have. And for those who don't know, I am half Japanese. So I love this Katsuri material that they used. Look at that. It's just super cool. I walked for like five hours straight in these. Can't see a crease in them. That's how nice they are. Moving on, we got the most limited of all the baits, as you can see. 404 out of 504. These are the ASIC. These are the Onitsuka Tiger times Accomplice times bait, 8,200 feet. These are made based off the Colorado flag and ski resorts. This thing is just so sick. Just so sick, you know? Super limited too. Take a shot at that tag right there. Size 10 and a half. They did a very exclusive raffle for these. I'm actually gonna probably pick up a second pair of these. They, they're they really cheap online and the materials on them are really cool. It's got awesome 3M striping on the sides. Haven't worn these yet, uh, but I'm gonna buy a second pair so I can rock these and have one in stock still though. Next up we have my only pair of the uh, ring pack. These are the uh, gel sagas, the black rings. Just the whole, I hope you can see this, but this thing is just buttery soft nubuck. Buttery soft. Just so sick. 3M piping all over the shoe. Love the gold insole. I don't know if it's even picking that up because of the color. Just a gold insole. Just so sick. Take that look at that tag. I love showing y'all the tag. These still uh, dead stock as well. I haven't rocked those yet. I'm probably gonna get some bait. They just came out with some bait rope laces, black and silver ones. So definitely gonna put those in there. So you know how it is. So we could get some real just sickness up in here with that. Let's move on. Uh, next up, we got the Fila times bait. They just came out. The next chapters, the 96s, red bottom, red interior, badass nubuck upper. Bam, you know how it is. And yes, by the way, these are all sneaker boxes down there. And these are all sneakers right here. And we got even more sneakers over here. For those who don't realize, my room is basically sneakers. Take a look at that one though. That one just came in today, the Gel Light Fives from my boys at Extra Butter. Those things are sick, cannot wait to rock those. Let's move on to this one though. This is my most prized shoe. Prized shoe from Bait. Snakeskin upper, uh, Reebok question, glow to dark midsole, smoked out bottom, patent leather on the toe, suede, you got like a awesome like I don't even know if you can see it, but you got like sweat pant interior. This thing is my favorite shoe. These are the Reebok questions. Super super limited. Like a thousand pairs of these were made. You had to wait online for like three hours to hopefully get those. Why the fuck is an ad playing? What the hell is this crap? What what is this shenanigans? What is this shenanigans right now? I hate it when ads play on my radio, man. I hate it when that when that happens, man. It's one of the most annoying things. It's like, yeah, I'm, you know, I'm listening to something. I'm feeling good. I'm doing well. And then all of a sudden, you know, like an ad comes up and I'm like, why'd you kill my vibe? Ooh, Childish Gambino. For those who don't know, Childish Gambino, aka Don Glover, one of the best rappers in the game. Seriously, check him out if you don't know already. Last but not least, shoe in my collection, we have the Socketing Cool World 2s. Looking for the ones still. Also, I'm looking for the Viridian Burners. But these were the uh, second rendition of the Cruel Worlds. All vegan shoe, as you can see. No animal cruelty. Uh, hopefully, you can see inside there. Can't really see. But we got a, uh, it says Cruel World right there. Get that tag right there. Non-violent construction. Just a sick shoe. I wear these are probably my third most worn bait shoes. I wear those all the time. Also, check a look at this bottom. I love the speckle. The speckled bottom, dude. More companies gotta do this. More companies gotta do that. Uh, next up, we've got, and last but not least, we've got two collectibles. For those who don't know, I love collectibles, and I had to pick these up. This was a, again. Hopefully, you could see that. 
Bait exclusive collectible Kid Robot times Street Fighter the Shin Akuma. Let me open it up here and let you all take a look at this because this thing is crazy, yo. This thing is absolutely crazy. Hold up. Look at that thing. This thing is sick. Let's throw it. Let's throw it next to. Uh, where's an Akuma right here? Boom. Mean mugging, folks. Look at those guys. Mean mugging. <laughs> Went over the 15 minute limit, don't care. Gonna finish this up, because we got one more thing left. And this is Cat Bug. For those who don't know, Bravest Warriors, it's a series on YouTube. One of my favorite series of all time. Just a sick, sick collectible. It does talk. It's about, it's like a nine inch vinyl. Costed 40 bucks, Anime Expo exclusive. Sold out immediately when it was there. Just an awesome collectible and with that said, I think I'm gonna end this video, guys. It's been 16 minutes. That is the whole bait collection, though. I took you through everything. We've got 16 shirts, three pairs of sh shoes, not, no, what am I talking about? Three pairs of socks, nine pairs of shoes, nine. I don't even have enough fingers for nine. Three hats, two collectibles, and one guy named the G Money 41 on YouTube, aka Connor Garrity in real life. You can hit me up on the Twitters at the G Money 41. Same thing on Instagram, the G Money 41. Also, I have to say thank you to Bait for always, always helping a guy out. Anytime I need some cool shoes or something, I'm always heading to Bait with the boys. You know, they're always hooking it up, they're always helping me out. They're always getting me the new stuff when I want it. They're always uh, making sure I get the exclusive stuff and exclusive news. Good people. If you're in California, please check them out. They got three stores now. Thank you to them. Thank you to all you subscribers who stuck with this video. And just much love to all of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And with that said, I am out. Again, this has been your boy, Karn Gary, a.k.a. The G Money 41. And with that said, going to hit y'all with the... Peace.